Okay, so you've just created the perfect logo design and now you have to supply not only your printer with the new layout, you're also required to create a web banner and the boss has just asked for some screen printed t-shirts and coffee cups plus a large vinyl sign cut and printed and probably a few other things. Well, all I can say is be thankful you're using CorelDRAW X5 because multi-output flexibility and integration, it's built right in. Come on, I'll show you how. We now have a new and convenient way to output all of the information regarding a design. If I choose File and Collect for Output, I'll go with Automatically Gather. I can now choose to include a PDF file based on a preset, I'll choose Prepress, the actual CDR file itself, gather all of the fonts that I want, include the colour profiles and place all of this into a zip file for my end required user. Let me open the zip. The zip file contains job information, font information, the actual fonts themselves, the CDR file of my design and the PDF. Let me open that. In this case I have a high quality PDF based on my pre-press output setting and the colour profiles that were used in this design. Well, all of this in a single zip file could not make life any easier for output. For the next phase of your project, you may need to export some graphics for the web. Select your graphics, the file menu, and we have a new option now, export for web. This new web export dialog provides you with a single point of access to output any type of web graphic you may require. Additionally, we have two real-time preview panes. In fact, I can expand that to four if I needed to. Select your pane. Right here, I have a GIF 128 dithered selected. And on the right, I'm going to compare that with a similar type of file, a PNG 8-bit 128 dithered. Of course, you want to zoom in, compare your transparent area, the color results, the file size at the bottom to make a decision. To make changes to your image, simply select that pane and your options become available on the right. For example, I might want to turn off transparency and choose to work with a matte color. And again, the anti-aliasing results are absolutely wonderful. Let me quickly show you the results of a PNG 24-bit. And as I zoom in, you can see the results are brilliant. Now don't forget, you can create your own custom settings for whatever final output you decide on. That means you have uniform output results throughout your entire project. If you would like to output more than just basic web graphics, Corel have now bundled Swish Minimax 2 with CorelDRAW X5 Suite. That means that you can now create flash animations. It comes with hundreds of multimedia effects, meaning you can create banners, rollovers, text animations, work with audio and script your flash files as required. Well, we have covered a lot of topics very briefly. And if you need some more specific information, make sure you check out the guidebook. If you're viewing these videos online and have not yet upgraded, let me encourage you to consider CorelDRAW Graphics Suite X5. It's faster, more intuitive, has more help available than ever before, and the number of new tools, features, and overall improvements to help you work smarter and quicker than ever before, in my opinion, makes CorelDRAW Graphics Suite X5 the right choice.